Now, when it comes to covering your building's insurance, many people over cover. Do you know what you should cover on buildings? Is it to rebuild it? Bingo. It's the rebuild, rebuild it. value of your property, not the house's value. So I have lots of people who come when I do my roadshows for my show and say, well, I've insured my house is worth, you know, £600,000, so I've insured the buildings for that. And I'm like, whoa, 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 that includes where it is. Mm -hmm. Actually, how much would it cost to knock it down and rebuild? In that case, it was 300 000. Because, of course, pounds. originally, when right. you're selling your house, you've got the garden, you've got the land, you've got yeah. whatever, whatever. But, so, of course, that's also, already still there. Still but also, there, where yeah. you are has a huge impact on your house's value. But, of course, what you're insuring is if something were to happen to the house, it would be totally knocked down, they'd have to rebuild it. How much would you pay them? And you cover it's that. Bricks and mortar. Bricks yeah, and mortar and building costs, okay. not the market value.